It's springtime here in Tennessee and my goodness, it is a beautiful 70 degree day and the bees are working the snow flowers. I think it's one of the most under talked about bee forages in early spring, especially in this area where we have miles and miles of ravines and creek banks that are just full of this humble little flower. It produces nectar and a pastel yellow pollen in our area. Also, the bees are working what's left of the wild mustard. There's just a little bit scattered around that shows up in fields. We have some planted over here of a different variety and also some crimson clover. But the bees are happy. They're bringing a lot of nectar. It's a beautiful day. And this is what we work so much for all year round for just about seven to eight weeks here in Tennessee, in my area, of actual strong nectar flow. These little colonies are doing great. They're just everywhere you can see in, in these fringed Facilia flowers, also known as the snow flower, there's just bees all throughout. Not just honeybees, native pollinators, bumblebees, so many types of little bees that depend on these little plants that don't get talked about. And all it takes is folks just not spraying around the creek banks or not mowing this area. It doesn't take much. It's beautiful. And who knows what else they're doing besides just feeding our bees. I'm sure they're very good for the soil as well. I just thought I'd share this moment with you. We have about a hundred and something colonies we need to get through. A lot of young splits here that need a little bit of TLC and just to see how they're doing and drawing some wonderful foundation. Thanks for watching our videos.